Hi everybody, welcome back to Rad Garage. I'm Rick, and to you first time viewers out there, if there's any of you, welcome to my garage where I get to spend a lot of quality time spoiling my car. So today is quite balmy in, in my city. It's only minus three degrees, and we've been minus 20 and below for about three weeks. So I'm sitting here in my shorts in my heated garage about to give my Audi SQ5 a very nice maintenance wash. Nothing crazy, just a nice maintenance wash. But um, I'm going to be trying out for the first time Auto Foam by Built Hamber. I've heard nothing but good things about this. It's finally available in Canada uh, through Carzilla. So I picked myself up this, uh, I don't know, four or five, this five liter jug. So I'll be giving that a shot for the first time today. And just to keep things even in more interesting, Instead of using my regular Adams all-in-one wheel and tire cleaner, I thought I would give this Turtle Wax wheel cleaner and tire prep product uh, a go. And I've also got this Hybrid Solutions Tire Shine Spray Coating from Turtle Wax that I'll finish the tires off in today, just to keep things a little bit fresh. Also for the wash, I'll be using for the first time Mystic Bubble by Tac System. Um, I'm not sure if this could be used as a foam or I, th I think it's I think it'd be good for a foam or a conventional mitt wash. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, try that out for the first time. <sighs> I'm a bit stressed because school starts up tomorrow. It's been three weeks. Um, so it's nice that I have this uh, garage that I can retire to when I'm feeling a little bit of pressure. So hopefully you'll enjoy the wash and it'll relieve any pressure you're feeling about life. So. Please stick around.
What a wash. She is gleaming for Monday. So I'm gonna head into the week with a nice clean car, doing, doing my best to uh, just keep going. So I used a lot of products today that I've never used before. Uh, starting with the uh, wheel cleaner and tire prep by Turtle Wax. I liked it. I think I used a bit too much on the first couple wheels. Uh, on the second, on the last two, I, I kind of calmed down. I, I notoriously overused my products, but I wanted to see what you know it was capable of. It's a good all-in-one. It's a good all-in-one. I'm not, not a huge fan of the smell. It's got an awkward smell. Hard to, hard to describe, sort of like medicinal. Uh, the Auto Foam by Built Hamber. I wasn't happy with the consistency. I have a feeling that has something to do with the fact that I read the label and you need a, like a PhD in applied chemistry just to figure out what the heck they're talking about with, uh, with dilution. So I just dropped a couple of ounces in my one liter foam cannon and yeah, it was pretty thin. I would have liked to have seen it a little thicker. So if you guys have any experience with Built Hamber Auto Foam, please drop me uh, some advice in the comment section. Uh, I really enjoyed the Tax System Mystic Bubble. That was the first time I used that wash and it was awesome. Uh, you know, it's <laughs> first time using it, it's already in my top five, I think. It was just so super creamy and thick and rich. Oh man, that was a, that's a nice, nice shampoo. I haven't, uh, I've had that bottle for a while and never used it. Uh, this is the problem with having too many products. Um, I did the door jams and did a final spray down with this uh, paint gloss by PNS, uh, showroom spray and shine. Loved it. I don't know why I haven't used this before. This is a great way to just get in the door jams, get all those little water spots. When I went over things with the Master Blaster, I blew a little bit of dirt out of the different crevices. So this was nice just to go over it. And I was uh, very impressed with the, um, the Turtle Wax Tire Shine. You know, I sprayed that onto one of my foam applicators, my Hex Grip applicators. It is a really, really nice tire dressing. I'm, I'm loving it. So um, yeah, I'd say four out of five, perfect. That built hamber just have a little bit of an issue with the, the mixture ratio. So like I said, if anybody has some advice for this old guy, please drop it below. But I'm ready for the week. I hope you have a great week. I hope you join me next time. And in the meantime, stay rad, everyone.